traveling and eating healthy is kind of hard, but um, I've been traveling for so long, I've tried try to get used to it. A big part of what I do is I bring things with me, like I always bring some good healthy bars and, you know, granola or something like that. Born on Kauai and lived there until I was six years old. My family moved to the mountains. So, I kind of grew up there, but I'll always call that home. I try to make lots of powder. Yeah. But I've been on a couple of college trips. I've been snowboarding since I was six years old. Uh, my dad taught me when we moved to mountains. I started doing USASAs when I was seven and just um, loved them, did them every weekend. I spent a lot of time in the gym. It's super important too you know, just keep my legs healthy and strong and, and be able to take some hard landings and, and some tough falls because that is just part of our sport. We are here at B Project. I'm gonna come and get my butt kicked for a little bit. Get strong for the season. In May, I got hip surgery. Pretty crazy. Tore a, a pad of cartilage in my hip. It's been kind of hurting me for a while and it was just time to get it fixed so I knew I was going to have to have surgery and, and kind of prepared for it. I was on crutches for six weeks so you know you lose a lot of muscle strength and, and everything when you're not walking. Uh, so just working on that is a big, big goal of my summer and, and it's going really good. With Elena we are kind of going through a process of taking her from kind of learning what her mechanics are and places where she has strengths and weaknesses and advancing it through into taking those weaknesses and trying to bring it up to her strengths and then progressing everything together um, so that she's a more mechanically efficient athlete. All right, just finished up my workout, a little sweaty. Gonna go cool off with the stand-up paddle. I love to run, so in the summer that's a big hobby of mine. Um, I do a lot of yoga. I love to cook. It's definitely one of my favorite things. Um, recently started drawing. Um, I do some art on my snowboards and I sketch. Looking forward, I mean, the next Winter Olympics is in Sochi, Russia, in 2014, and I definitely would love to be there and represent the USA again. The Olympic stage is really like no other. You know, there's there are hundreds of thousands of people watching you, um, but. I try not to think about that because <laughs> that's definitely intimidating. Um, you know, I think you just gotta, you have to play your own game and not worry about what contest you're at and, and what you, who might be watching you, what you might be doing because really when it comes down to it, it's just about riding your best and having fun and, and doing what you love. And I think it's gonna take a lot of hard work, a lot of time an effort put into training on snow, training off snow, um, a lot of competing over the next couple years, but I'm going to do everything I can to make it to the Olympics in 2014.